Welcome back, guys. This is a continuation of my last episode. Let's play you play. Now, if you look... Oh, never mind. You, you can't look. But... I now have the ability to make coal blocks. I think you should get out of the sun. Here, come on in. No. You know what? No. I'm going to kill you first. Hey, buddy. Hey, does that hurt? Does that hurt? I think it hurt. Sad. Okay, so as I was saying, I now can make coal blocks. That's really going to help me. Because I am... Uh, because the reason why I don't get so much coal is because it's everywhere. And I don't know what to do with it. But now you got coal blocks. That's going to be awesome. And um, this coal block act actually is a money saver in the way of, um, in the way of cooking things up. Uh, it actually, so it's made out of nine coal as you saw. But it cooks as long as 10 pieces of coal. Thank you, dinner bone. Now, I just put that in there. That feeds it right there. Then... Now! Batch! Now, ignore, ignore the, uh... The non-completeness... Isisness. Never saw this. Boom. Yeah. Okay. Now, now I can. Uh, now what I can do? I can just throw all my all the crap I want to cook in here. No, what I'll do it automatically feed it in there. Put it through the hopper, and then into the chest. Magic! Ah! All right, so what am I gonna need? Oh yes, I can make almost, but not an iron golem. Cool thing about iron golems is that they don't die as easy. Uh, a little bit. Maybe the music's just a little bit loud. There we go. I think that might be. I think that might be a little bit better for you guys. I'm not sure. Yeah. So I did get new video software and all. It's just that I don't have any. I don't have any. Uh, any uh, video measure or it like uh, oh, what's it called um, like it, it, it's uh, it's like the it's like the movie equivalent of Photoshop <laughs> um, you know where where you can where I can I'm able to cut out then come back in and if YouTube actually has that then I guess I'm a damn fool um, but, since I don't have any type of uh, external video software like that, I have to pretty much keep on going with my episodes. So I can't really as easily cut out as I would want to. And that would definitely reduce some of the space that I have. Um, Beam, why don't I uh, get some of this? Mm, yes, back to the uh, back to oh, damn. back to the story at hand um, about the uh, about my about my dream. Now, this was actually a nightmare for me. Um, so, as I, as I was saying, um, 
it was uh so yeah the mon the monsters are the good guys and this kid pretty much uh, pretty much what happens is that these uh, that these 17 soldiers or these 17 toys uh, actually escape and these toys are part of like a like a series like um, you know like uh, bionicles where you'd have like the good bionicles and the bad bionicles it's been a long time since I've played with those um But, uh, so, nat naturally, uh, naturally the, uh, what's it called, um, hmm, there was a word for this, uh, so naturally when these things come alive, they're going to pretty much remember each other of who they are, what they are, and stuff like that. Uh, to, uh, and who's their enemy. Well, what happened is that the, I believe, now this has been a long time since I, since I watched this movie, so if you, so if any of you watched this recently, uh, go ahead, go ahead and, uh, correct me if I, if I'm wrong. But as I was saying, let's see if I can't, uh, okay, 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 okay. There we go. Get my golds. I still haven't found chickens. Oh, and uh, with 1.6, I believe I can now make carpet, if I know how to. Oh, there we are. Definitely makes wool a lot easier to use. Definitely does. I think I might actually save a sheep now. Or two. But I'm not getting soft. Those things are fucking bastards. Oh, hey. I'm an animal full of meat. Oh, wait. You can't eat me. Bite me. Oh wait, you can't. Oh yeah, and you and it tells you the uh, attack damage of things. How much does a nope? Apparently a stone hoe doesn't have damage. Man, I'm hungry. Boom, five bread. All right, so the uh, what I'm thinking I might do on this episode is... Wow, that thing's still going. What I'm going to do... Ooh, isn't there uh, a lead that I can make? Uh, how do you make a lead? <laughs> Ah, piss. No! Ah! Uh, one second. Uh, while I'm waiting for... I have... this wonderful thing called... Hold a phone. 
Well, while, while I'm looking this up, I can actually tell you more of that nightmare thing. Still gotta do the, the background story. So, pretty much, um... The, uh, the, the gist of, of it is that the, uh, is that the, that the toy soldiers are the, an are enemies with the monsters and vice versa. It just so happens that, um, it just so happens that, uh, the soldiers, I believe, uh, they, the chips are defective and they turn extremely bad which that's bad the way they they try to they try to go around and kill people and the monsters the monsters are are uh, are just trying to hide actually they originally are just hiding and this kid finds them he for a second freaks out and then he's like oh wait a minute Maybe I can help these guys. And, um... They pretty much... That's pretty much what happens. They they help them. Uh, all the bad soldiers are... Blown to it up. And, uh... Happy day for all, yeah? Okay. Come on, stop being a... Well, now now that you now that you pretty much got um, what pretty much what it is uh, the thing the thing uh, the the nightmare was with one of the monsters. Oh, I need slime balls. Damn, I wanted to make a lead. That way I could, uh, if I were to find a horse. Yeah. If I were to find a horse, I would, uh, I would bring it back here. Because I don't have a, uh, saddle right now. Alright, that was a good, like, five, ten minutes I wasted. Alright, so... What I'm gonna do is there. There are two things. It's still raining. Wow. Didn't know I was in the Washington biome. Oh. Okay. That's better. So now that I got pumpkins, I really don't need to worry about uh, uh, going and looking for a pumpkin. What do I want? Mm. Do I want it to be black or red? Or yellow? No. 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 Stop. There we go. Ah, there we go. That's exactly what I wanted. Where did my wheat go? Oh, I put it back. Dang. This is one of the few times I'm going to play nicey nice with you, alright? Yeah, exactly. You don't tell any of your friends what I'm about to do. It's not that I'm going soft, it's just that I'm using you right now, alright? The word using you. Remember that. Remember. So come back and use this on you. Yeah. Yeah. You better look me... Yeah. Now go away. I'm done with you. Run along. Tell your friends. I'm sorry. I have to do this. Oh, man. I really hate sheep. Oh, man. They're so useless. Remember this day. I'm going to come back for you next.
but seriously, sheep are really worthless. Unlike cows. Oh, look at them. With their blank stare, not knowing what's about to happen. They are so versatile. I mean, one, you get leather. Two, you get experience. Three, you get meat. And four, but not last, you get milk. And what does sheep do? They only give you wool. Why don't you get a real job? Like him. Cows, I kill because I have to. Sheep, I kill because I want to. Any of your friends looking? Sorry about your family. It was a necessary price. Nah, I just killed this family because it was fun. <laughs> really? Oh, yeah, right there. Uh, caves and bats. Hmm. What am, you know what? I think I should actually start working on this just a little bit. Um. Should I actually fill this up? Nah, it, it, that's what gives it a nice look. What I might actually do, I might actually lengthen this, I might, or uh, deepen it. And then make it where it actually goes around. Completely around. Uh, I might bring this out a little bit right to you here. Or not. That's just going to be a pool. <laughs> um, nice little watered down area. Okay, so... I think I'm going to just... I am real I am sorry. I'm trying to do this. I'm trying to tell you about my dream and I'm doing a really bad job of it. All right. All right. All right. All right. So, I gave you the gist of the good guys and the bad guys. Now, my nightmare was actually about the monsters. They uh even though they're good, for a little kid, I think I might have been uh 6 at the time. So that's uh so that's like 12 years ago this was made. Um the the monster now I don't think the mon this monster actually was in the movie uh or not but what it was is that it was it was like an armadillo it was like an armadillo slash uh, triceratops. You know, the one with, uh, with the three horns? And it, it, the way its body was, it was like an armadillo. And, wh and what it did, it came... And there, I was like in this really close quarters warehouse with a lot of rooms... And I was running with like some friends uh, from from this thing, and then all all of a sudden, all of a sudden, there was another monster which looked like an ogre with a uh, with like a uh, wooden uh, a wooden uh, wooden arm, which was a club. And wow, this is nice. Um. Yeah, a wooden club, and he came, and pretty much, we get into this room, we think, we're, we, we're about to rest, and all of a sudden, boom, to the whole, the whole, uh, one of the walls just explodes into, into debris, and then this guy comes out, and he's like, ah, 
uh, which translates, I'm going to eat you for a seven-year-old. So I'm really scared. I run. And then all of a sudden we look down this hallway, which was about, um, which was about like 20 feet, a narrow pathway like that you would see like in some type of horror film. And then all of a sudden, this Triceratops armadillo thing just pops out of nowhere. And it's like... And it pretty much meaning, meaning, I'm going to run over you, and then kill you, then eat you, but not in that order. And then, it turns into its armadillo phase, or whatever. And it just comes straight at us, rolling at us. But, I, I don't know... I don't really know what what's going on because as it's coming towards me, I stick my hands out like anybody would. That's scary shit. I stick my hands out to stop it and then it collides with my hands and it just stops. And then it goes back and then comes back at me like, like uh, just like that. And as it keeps on doing that, it pretty much... Um, Pretty much, each time it hits me, it's, uh, it's, it, like, it's flesh is peeling away where my hands contact it, as, as if, like, you were breaking glass or something. I woke up. I was scared as shit. I believe that was the same night I had the double dream. Which was a scary dream, I believe, with the monsters. And then, and then, I was in my bed at the time, and I was really scared. And I went up to to go to my dad and tell him I had a nightmare. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, right when I stepped down, hands come out and grab me. I am s pissing myself scared right now. And then I wake up again. I am not getting out of that bed. I am calling for my dad. Oh man, I was scared. Oh, I. Whew. I'm talking. Uh, no, just. I mean, if I had the same dream again, it wouldn't be that scary. But for the time, at the time being, like I said, I was seven years old. That's some scary stuff going on. <laughs> Uh, what am I doing? Ah, yes. I need to go find a wolf. Oh, let's see. Do I have dirt? Yeah, I have dirt, but I have a lot of other crap. I'm going to need to get rid of some of this stuff. Man, there's a lot of caves. Gonna need to get rid of some of this stuff. I might wanna... No, my armor's alright, but I might wanna update some of my tools. Um... Alright, so... I got seeds. Uh, just in case if I find some chickens. Some wheat... I actually might do... Nope, don't have enough iron. Oh, wait, yeah, I do. I might actually do to make it a lot simpler. Nope, fuck it. Alright, sleep. Maybe a nice blue instead. I got the lapis. All right. So, actually, I'll do. I'll bring the whole. I'll bring the whole stack along. Put the leather there. Uh, might bring the shears. Not really sure if I should. Oh well. Uh, bring the. F I'll bring the flint. Uh. Bring the wood. Don't need the hoe. We'll want the jack jack o' lanterns. Uh... There we go. Actually, I might want to 
just bring one of those. I'll make it two. Do I really need an axe right now? Yeah, just in case. If I run into something that I'm going to need an axe for. Alright, I do not need the string though. See guys, I have a lot of wool and I don't even I don't even farm sheep. Besides besides that one because he's not my bitch. Oh, there we go. Put that there. I don't need bone meal. I do need bones though. I do know, oh, there we go, got bones. I might want to get two more, though. Don't need the red rose. Might want to bring the cobblestone. You know what, I'll, uh, I'll bring that much. We'll bring the seeds, we'll bring the torches. That way I know how many arrows I have. Don't need the seeds in my pack right now. Don't need ink. Don't need the string. Mm, yeah, why not? Uh, food on the go, I guess. Um, oh, wait a minute. I forgot. Alright. Yeah, sorry about this whole inventory management thingy. I still need that anvil. <laughs> Anvil. But whatever. Um, let's see. Okay, so what I'm going to need to do... I'm going to actually grab a block of dirt... Before we get started. Let's go do this. Um, actually, it is running on 30 minutes. Sorry. You know what? Um, after this, after this episode, once I upload this, I'll immediately start on another one. Uh, I'll. What I'll actually start doing, I'll start. Um, when the majority of the episode is inventory management, I'll just place that as episode whatever inventory management. Um, although, I did make a bitch, a bitch out of a sheep. I will, uh, so that way you guys don't have to sit through all this without, uh, w without actually being able to see anything good. Well... So long, guys. This has been Dead X Dying. Let's play, you play. See you next time.